Well, new numbers at four show just how much more we're paying, paying for auto insurance. Your rates have likely gone up, most are nationwide. In a Consumer 10 report, Gabriela Garcia looks into what you can do to save a few bucks. We've heard about federal interest rate hikes affecting every part of our budget. Now, that includes how we get around. In the last year, Ohioans minimum coverage for car insurance is up 54%. Full coverage is up 56%. That's higher than the national average. What's happening, I think, for lots of reasons. One, like, just general inflation. The Federal Reserve has, in, like, raised the rate, like, 11 times since March 2022. In order to kind of keep up with that, like, Companies are having to raise their rates. Raising their rates to catch up with not only inflation, but post-COVID supply chain issues. If you need to repair a part, it costs more to repair that part now. Also, we've kind of noticed that according to the J.D. Power study, there was like just longer wait for car repairs in general. Like the car repair appointments just are taking longer. Drexler says climate change is another reason for higher car insurance rates. She says farmers insurance is no longer going to provide their services in Florida, a state known for its hurricanes and storms. Coverage costs also go up for fire prone areas. So what can we do? Drexler says don't sit still. I know it can be a pain, but actually try to shop around. They have the safe driving programs. And then there's also obviously if you're a student, there's student, there's like senior ones. For 10 TV News, I'm Gabriela Garcia. Experts say they are optimistic these kinds of price jumps won't last forever, but as long as the federal interest rates keep hiking, costs will keep climbing.